first thing you're going to need to do is make a recording. Good news is that you don't have to buy anything. There's a free recorder. Now what you're going to want to do is open it and set your options. So what you'll want to set is your microphone and where you want it to be saved when it's finished. You just click here. The rest of the stuff you can choose as you like, but those are the two things you need to set. Click OK. Now all you do is click on the record button and record an audio. So just click record and then you start recording and as you can see the bars are going across here as it records. When you're done click stop and it's finished. Now you can click play and it plays it back. Okay, now it saved it for you where you told it to save it. So we saved it on our desktop. And it has a funny name. It starts with free high Q and a bunch of numbers after it. So just rename it to something that makes sense. So in my case, I'm just going to rename it to test. And it recorded it in MP3 format. So I end up with a file called test dot mp3. Now what you have to do is embed the code into your website. So let's go find a website you want to embed the code in. Actually I'll just do it on a blank page and just show you how it's done. So we'll open up Notepad and if this was your web page there'd be a bunch of code here and you just embed it wherever you want it to appear. If you don't know how to do that you could just open a you could just open your website in a web editor like Composer or whatever you use and just insert the HTML code. Now in your resources document, here it is here, you'll see that it has embed code. All you do is you grab this code right here and you just copy it. Then you paste it into your web page. So if this was my web page, I'd have a bunch of web, website code here. And then I say I wanted to play my video after this. So I could just insert the code right here. And if I wanted to put a comment above it, I could just say, let's say, listen to the audio. And then I'll just paste that embed code in there. Now, all we have to do is put the location where our audio file is on the web. Now if you put it right where your web page is, for instance if your web page is on yourdomain.com and you upload your audio file to yourdomain.com, that's all you need to put here. So since my web page is on my desktop, or is going to be on my desktop, and my audio file is going to be on my desktop, all I have to do is change this to the name test.mp3. Now this is an mp3 file that this player creates and that's all I have to do. So if I save this now, I'll do a save as and I'm just going to call it page.html. But you would just save, you would probably just do a save if you already had a web page because I just created a simple web page here. Now let's open this. Do an open with Firefox. Okay, so there it is. Uh, there's a simple little code I put in there. And here's our embed code. Now when we press the play button, it is now playing the audio. And it worked just like it should. So that's it. That is a simple and free way that you can embed audio on your website.